try to apologize in person. A conversation from eye to eye is always better than communication via text message, email, chat, or even via a call. If possible, allow the other person to hear your voice, to see your facial expressions, and vice versa. If you quickly type that you are sorry for what happened, you can't see their reaction either. If an in-person apology is not possible, a FaceTime, Skype, Zoom, WebEx session, or any virtual meeting room is probably your next best bet. That being said, as others see you in person or via webcam, be careful with your non-verbal cues. Say it out loud, I am sorry. And it will only sound authentic and real to others if you actually mean it. Express your regret around the situation with honesty and humility. This is the first step to gaining back trust and accepting forgiveness. That being said, claim the blame. Say, I realize I made a mistake or I understand you were hurt. Also, don't shift part of the blame onto someone in an attempt to reduce responsibility. And it is very important not to get defensive and make excuses. It's also risky here to over explain your actions because by trying to explain why you thought your behavior actually was right you're missing the point and make others think you still don't get it simply admit what went wrong it will show those around you that you do not operate from your ego